everybody welcome back today guys to the channel back here uh for a little bit of disappointing news man we have been teased with this beautiful open world journey of what car x street was supposed to be now obviously we've played it a little bit on the mobile side of things on the ipad and it's been fun however right it's not that full experience that we've been waiting for and we've been patiently waiting it has now been almost two years since this game was announced and said it was going to be out obviously you know things have happened delay after delay after delay which has led us here and car x street hit us with a doozy the other day and they basically said they needed more time again. We're gonna talk about it today. I actually found this out from Goosiest. Uh, he let me know on Discord and uh, I honestly didn't even know about it, right? It blindsided me. I was waiting for this game. I thought this was gonna be a huge year for the end of uh, 2022 just to make that Car X Street push on the wheel with a nice free roam game. We're gonna talk about it for today though. Huge thank you for coming around once again. And of course, before we start, dad joke of the day coming from Seth Burl, six two nine oh and he goes thanksgiving dad joke which right just happened happy thanksgiving hopefully everybody had a great turkey day uh he goes what did the turkey say before he got roasted man i'm i'm stuffed right oh my god and you get the itis and then you pass out on the couch and then you're out for three four hours you wake up fully rested and it's 12 o'clock right <laughs> huge thanks for watching for today and of course don't forget to slap that like button uh, I found an interesting video. This was my episode of Car X Drift Racing on October 26th, 2020. So we were talking about that in the comments section and I found some interesting dates actually. We had one here from Ross Perkins and he goes, you're correct with the street delay. Unfortunately, it was supposed to be released November 5th. If you look through the discussions on the newest update about the day-night cycle, you can read about everyone's disappointment, which I'm sure there is a whole slew of disappointing comments uh, regarding this kind of delay. I mean, obviously right before Christmas time, right they hit us with that right and then we had one here from pluto dust he said it originally was supposed to be out november the 5th but a few days ago it got delayed to a year later which sucks so it's hopefully it doesn't lose its hype it already has and kills the game before it even comes out this guy thinking that it comes out in 2021 man get wrecked we have to wait another two years and change for this one to come out from this comment date that's rough so august 22nd we got a message here and this was uh, obviously a couple months ago and he goes what's up drivers need more time to prepare for pc version of car x street project for you to enjoy we continue to work hard to make sure car x street meets all your quality and detailization expectations and the more we work the more we want to do for this project but we believe that we've found the right balance between desire and possibility so you will soon be able to appreciate our work estimated release date on steam december 15th 2022 thank you for staying with us well that was a lie right what the heck man right i'm kidding obviously i know that it's obviously not on purpose but it just it sucks man they're just dangling that carrot in front of us here just a little bit longer here just a little bit longer just until december 15th obviously that was determined to be false out here because obviously we just got one on december the first saying what's up drivers the pc version of car x street isn't ready for the release either because we need more time to implement and develop all the features we'd like to see in this version properly car x street has been available for ios players from all over the world for almost two weeks and we've received a lot of comments and feedback that helped us understand that the pc version of our project has to be bigger and more detailed than it is now you seen some work in progress results and some of our work on mountain drive on screenshots attached this is the good news is that we have more resources to work on the pc version and we are doing our best to bring the final result as soon as possible thanks a lot for staying with us and they hit us with a couple screenshots so that's nice here we're gonna go over those in a second car Street has been available on ios players for over almost two weeks still nothing on android either that's rough man <laughs> The main thing about this is that we're just getting a big open world map, right? That's really the biggest thing about it. So I think that's what they're really struggling with is getting this map up to par for everybody's expectations, whether it be, you know, the trees, the grass, the road textures out there, maybe the lights. Uh, so it seems like they've bit off a lot more than they can chew considering this game was supposed to be out two years ago, right? So it's come a long way, obviously. I'm sure the online side of things is definitely causing some issues in terms of connectivity making sure everything works for day one launch um, and just making sure that everyone has a good overall experience I think the I think the worst part about this they don't even give us a date on this last post they just we're just pushed out into the water man we're on our raft 
and they say have a great trip out here you know what come on back maybe in a month we'll see you after christmas and uh we'll try it again right and i love the car x team out there they've been doing some huge things for over a decade now right i mean we want the game to be as good as possible for everyone to play and enjoy so hopefully everybody does have that same overall feel we're gonna go over those screenshots in a second but a hundred and one comments on here let's discuss let's see what's going on here you have an estimate on how much car x street will cost uh, I think it's going to be free to play because it's having a tag of free to play on the store page. Is it? I didn't know that. It says, I really hope it won't be. The microtransactions will be hell if it's going to be free to play. That's very true, actually, because obviously uh, CarX Street on the mobile device, I already had to put in $10. I seen Black Panther's video. He put $100 in. Right, so it's definitely going to be littered with transactions for sure. Now, we did have Memphis here. He goes, by the time we get this, we'll have Test Drive Unlimited Solar Crown, but we currently have this new Need for Speed Unbound, so I guess we have the slot filled already, which it's kind of true. I've actually really been enjoying Unbound right now, and it is taking up quite a bit of time. I don't know about you guys, but I'm playing on intense mode, and it's intense. The cops do not let up. You have to avoid them at all costs, especially, uh, you know, Heat 3 and above, and it's kind of getting hard to bank large chunks of money on those nightly runs. So, right, I, right, it's been fun. It's been challenging at the same time, and obviously online's a totally different side of things, which I like that they separated both of those concepts. So I think that was a huge thing. And tomorrow we're gonna be coming around with the top 10 things that uh, is missing in Need for Speed Unbound, right? It's just not there. I'm not really too sure why they did it to us, but uh, come on by tomorrow to see the list. Subscribe with post notifications. If you guys are brand new, click the bell for all future content on the channel. And obviously Car X Street was supposed to be a big game for us here for the last stretch of December out here. But I do have my new computer being built. So there's gonna be a lot of possibilities Possibilities. A lot of a set of course are going on as well too with maximum graphics So I'm really excited for the future here on this channel, right? And I'd love to know down below in the comment section what you guys want to see And so we did have one here from autistic and he kind of Was commenting on this guy's post. He's not happy about the uh, actual delay for time being delayed Why are you lying? to your audience over and over again. Pretty harsh. And he commented, he goes, have you perhaps considered that this game is coming from a team of independent devs? Because with little in time of resources, delays happen, especially with smaller dev teams. How's about not making false assumptions, man? Delayed for three to four years. I don't even know at this point. It's pointless to say good that you guys are delaying it so you can deliver us a finished product. It won't even be close to finished when they finally release it. Closer to early access, man. I don't know. How do you guys feel about the delay on here? Are you you guys happy about it obviously two years is a long time they've been just delay after delay and i think the worst part about this one is that they didn't even tell us really anything about it it's just hey what's up drivers we're delaying more features so i think that's really the biggest thing if they would have maybe went in depth with it saying hey you know what we got the release coming up in two weeks super sorry about what's happened but you know, point A, B, C, D were the things that we wanted to bring into the final product and it can't happen. So here's the next release date time frame. And there's not even a time frame, man. It's definitely rough to see it. And we did get some screenshots though. So let's at least enjoy the screenshots here. Uh, we have a little mountain row. We got a bunch of water. I will say though that the lighting and the atmosphere definitely does look good for the nighttime. All right. I mean, you can see the lighting on, on, on the big bridge looks really good and crisp. We got the signs down below being lit and then the reflections in the water. Quite nice. Quite nice. It's a two year delay nice. I will say that for sure. Um, and then we got this bridge here going into a tunnel looks like. So we got a little tunnel section. And I don't know if this is on the Car X Street map on the mobile device. It'd be nice if they brought us a big expansion for Car X Street on the PC, which I think this is though. I don't remember this big mountain section being on Car X Street on the mobile. If it is, let me know, please. But this looks huge, though. Exactly what we needed here on Car X Street Map. And uh, I'm pretty excited to run this. Hopefully, it takes us about, you know, five to seven to ten minutes to get down this whole thing. I feel like a good downhill, at least five minutes, right? Minimum five minutes for a good downhill. Good shots here, night, right? Beautiful sky out in the distance. Some roads coming down. We got the fall trees. And just a bunch of trees and grass and water on this one. We're putting this game back in the wish list because uh, <laughs> I'll be wishing for this thing to come out any day now, right? Hopefully they drop us on Christmas Day, imagine? Right, I'd love to know your thoughts down below on the whole situation here on Car X Street being delayed. I had to get an episode out to talk about it just to get it off my chest, man. It sucks, it really does. I'm a huge Car X fan, 
really have been enjoying their games over the last decade and uh, can't wait for this one. However, hopefully it's not like a GTA 6 situation where we're just waiting five years down the road. <laughs> Huge thanks for watching and uh, let me know your thoughts down below and everything. I'll see you guys back here tomorrow. I'm out. Peace.